I might have the perfect plug and play answer to uh, solar for a home or on a go in the apartment for under 300 or about $300. This is Solaris Pop. It is a plug and play solution that will transfer up to 160 watts theoretically of solar sun power directly from the panel right into your house. It is a plug and play solution designed for do it yourself. As you can see, it's pretty big. It is actually one square meter. And as you, most of it, of course, is the actual solar panel itself. And inside there is an included stand. Now what sets this apart from other solar solutions is the very fact that you have a micro tie grid inverter right there built smack and glued right onto the solar panel. So you just basically take it out and plug it into your socket, your wall socket here in the United States, and it will just feed energy right back into your system. So um, the installation is actually fairly easy. They advertise on the actual site that you can be up and running in less than 10 minutes, which is true. If you open up the box, take out the solar panel, point it towards the sun, and plug that right into your socket, then you're good to go. It actually takes about uh, 30 seconds for it to uh, notice that it is plugged into your, uh, your power outlet, and then it starts transferring um, all that power that it's collecting from the solar cells directly in through the inverter, which then converts it over to that 120 volt and puts it right back into your system. So it says that the generator is rated 160 watts and um, one square meters. However, the maximum that I've gotten out of it so far is just around 100 watts here in the summer. And this is testing it out here in California where you know the summer sun is pretty out and uh you know really bright and i said so i get a, a, most of the sun um during the day so um in the usage by this being a grid tie inverter you also can request up to a 30 percent federal solar tax credit which is awesome because normally when you buy a solar panel and it's not a whole solution and it's it's um, it's kind of a directly off the grid versus plug into the grid solution, you don't get federal tax credits uh, for it as high as the 30% here over in the United States. So so you can get a, up to 30% of this price deducted deducted from your federal uh, tax uh, bill. Um, as far as the rest of the advertised. Uh, information in here it claims uh, you know fine it, this is this is sold by Ren Factory it, it claims it is fine Italian design um, the only thing I can see out about it is that it's you know really totally slim but I gotta say the materials around it this is basically just kind of like a rubber siding that's plugged that's kind of glued on there and it gets kind of loose in the heat um, otherwise this is this is pretty much all you're getting um, in also in the advertising it shows it being stuck up against the side of the wall of the building I wouldn't trust that with whatever mount that they give you here so that that's gonna be sold separately which is a little disappointing because if you look at that picture um, on on the uh, site and link down below it looks like it's it's something that you can just um, just attach with the included stuff real easily within minutes um, up against the building and I, I, I definitely wouldn't trust it. In fact, even in the Q&A section, it recommends that uh, when you're not using it, you should take it back inside the house. So this is probably not some sort of industrial solution that uh, you're gonna keep outside round the clock. Well, you know, if I'm wrong, um, hopefully Ren Factory reaches out and comments and says, uh, you know, this is, this, this is uh, good for that. It's got a 10 year warranty. The thing with these warranties though, is you never know if the business is gonna be around for 10 years. However, um, with all that said, I did uh, I, I, I have uh, some solar panels that I've, I've had for a good 10 years and you know they're still working. Uh, some parts of it are a little bit broken, but um, you know they are still working so solar technology has gotten quite a bit uh, better. As far as the efficiency of this, this is not going to be the most efficient. I mean, for $300, I don't know what you're kind of really expecting. Um, these are not the mono crystals, uh, mono crystalline uh, type of solars. They're the other type, which I believe is called the, um, what was it, the uh, polar, uh, poly, the poly type. So the poly type is less efficient um, at, than the mono crystalline type. And uh, another thing that you should note is this, this, really loses basically most of its power unless it's pointed right smack at the sun. 
So if you're gonna you want to get the maximum power, just over 100 watts, you got to point it smack at the sun. If it's if it's just a little bit off, you know, perpendicular to the sun, even if it's just a little bit off, you lose half the efficiency, potentially more with uh, with this these type of solar panels. Still, for three hundred dollars, my God, there's there's no better bargain out there right now for a direct uh, direct out of the box solution that will give you power and produce that power right away, right to your home, merely just by plugging in. And almost anybody can do it. All right, so if you are interested in trying this out, uh, please check out my links on the screen, on QR code and down below. And uh, you know, if you consider purchasing it, um, do check it out. And of course, I got this from Amazon. And this is not sponsored or endorsed by any companies. Uh, this is something I picked up uh, after I've been tracking it for a while. And three hundred dollars is the absolute lowest price I've ever seen this for. When I started tracking this, this was around four or five hundred dollars. And uh, you know, once it hit three hundred, I'm like, wow, this is easily the uh, biggest bang for the buck if it did did, did um, if, if it did uh, follow through with the promise of it. Even though it fell short of 160 watts so far right now, um, I think those are just you know inflated numbers. So if you expect maybe 100, 100 watts, 110, uh, generally when it is out and brightest during the day, then uh, then you know you should be pretty happy with it. All right, that's it for this first initial look review. Um, if you are interested in a follow-up review on this, please comment down below if you have a better solution or you think you have a better or if you want to share with everybody what you're doing right now and if this will work for you, please comment down below. Let me know. And I will catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching.